Hey guys, me again. <clears throat> wow, that was a crack of a voice. Try that again. Hey guys, me again. There we go. Um, let's see. I, um, how do I go when you explain this? I talked with my mother and with my, uh, grandmother about finding happiness. Um, uh, I made a video on finding happiness and how, and the, the video consisted basically of me saying that I talked to my grandmother and my mother about finding happiness. Um, I decided, um, that I am needing to tone down my religion a little bit. And because of that, I, uh, decided that I was going to take down a few altars and put everything away for a little while. So I have two altars now. My working altar and my altar to La Satissima Muerte. Now, this brings me to the point of the video in showing you La Satissima Muerte's altar and then showing you why I did this. So, let's get started. Her altar. First off, the incense area is right here. I have all of these things that burn incense here. Her muddy bottle, her little tiki guy, her uh, uh, ba -ba 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 God's Eye, and then my candle for inspiration. That area is specific, is um, beautiful in itself, um, but it gets even more beautiful when we go on. So, then we have the center of the altar. The Bible, the smudge, the two, the candles here, her, uh, this is probably my favorite part of the altar is her statue area, where I, sa I have two blood sacrifices because I sacrificed blood to Hecate and I didn't want to waste it, so I decided to give it to her. Um, I have her gems, her money, bo her money bag, her, uh, little thing of, uh, uh, hand sanitizer, cayenne pepper, and a bottle of, uh, mixed herbs for her. And then I added the turkey feathers and everything to add a little bit of flourish to it. And then, of course, her roses. And then the other two candles. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six candles on her altar. Um, it brings us over to this section of the altar where we have two white candles here. I might be adding another one of these things or two more black candles over there, or two more white candles over there. I don't know. Um, I have to look about uh, if I have any more white candles to give her. Um, but all of her sacrifices are here. Her coffee, her water, her cigarette, her um, cookie, her mint, her honey, her candies, her jewelry, her fruit. Everything is here. And then the prayer box is way over here, surrounded by three, uh, 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 shells, and then her Mexican, um, folded papers. <sighs> so, I did this because my mother was right in suggesting that, um, I might need to tone down my religion. Um, because I was being absorbed by it. It was being really, it was really taking a toll on me. I was really, really, um, sad and depressed all the time. So, I don't know. It's just, it's just somewhat better now. I feel a little better. Um, I feel empowered. Um, that I was able to go through the task of doing, taking down three altars. Um, 
because I took down my Hecate altar, I took down my ancestor altar, sort of, I'm still working on taking that part down, and I took down my uh, altar to Venus, Aphrodite, whatever you want to call her. Um, and, yeah, um, it was, it was grueling, it was really grueling taking those things down, because it, I put so much time and effort into them, and then I just decided to take them down, it was really, really hard, because there's a lot of memory behind how much, how much I put into it, but, whatever. Anyway, um, kind of redid my nails, kind of ruined them a little bit more than I already had, don't know how I managed that, but, um, yeah. I don't know. My nails look like a three-year-old did them, and I guess I'm kind of a three-year-old at doing nails because I don't know how to do nails. So, yeah. But I'll learn, eventually. Anywho, um, yeah. So, that's, that's all that. Um, I have some extra fruit and uh, Hecate's leek here, so I'm going to take these downstairs and put them in the fridge, and we'll use them when we use them, um, but yeah, so now I'm trying to figure out what to do with that. This is just blank now, and I don't know what to do with it, so I might um, just leave it as a dresser. Honestly, that's what that's probably the best thing for me to do is just leave it as a dresser and not do anything with it. Um, so yeah. I don't know. But yeah, so that's that guys. Um I hope you liked the video. Give me likes, comments, subscriptions please. Um if you like the change, if you think that it's a good idea for me to take down three altars and you think that I should have done that, leave it in the comments down below, please. And, uh, yeah, until next time, I hope to see you all later. I love you very much. And, yeah. Bye, guys.